we do a couple solos with Manny now? It's nice to meet you. Why don't we have Peter join? Go ahead. I knew Christmas with the Campbells is kind of like a love letter to Hallmark movies. Is that right? Can you say that? You know, kind of. I mean, we had a woman who writes a ter terrific Hallmark movies, write a real kind of story Barbara. with the emotion. Barbara Barbara Kimlica, correct. But we put a lot of hard R comedy in there. So it's both funny and kind of heartfelt. Now, how do you draw that fine balance between like it being a parody and actually sincerely just a love letter? That was the interesting part. So it's right. a, we play it straight. We have a Hallmark composer, editor, cinematographer, Production director. Designer. <laughs> yes, but exactly. the language and the points of view of the character is straight comedy. So it's a very interesting blend. And uh, you know, obviously the movie's tested really well. So we're just excited to finally have a world premiere here in Toronto. There's so many fans here. And oh we don't God. betray the rules of a Hallmark movie. So they all follow that. And there's a really good feeling at the end. And you definitely laugh a lot along the way. Now I know you have a real affinity for Toronto. You've got family here. But what's, thing that, what's one thing that Toronto's got that you can't find anywhere else in the world? Gosh, you know, I think Toronto's a city where, you know, people are with their families, raising families, and they're going to work. It's a it's a real city where, you know, people enjoy themselves. It's a great tradition of Canadians out of here. And, you know, for me, it's special. My mom was born here, so I used to come all the time as a kid to see family. I still have a lot of family here, so it's just a great city. I think a lot of film fans, Toronto International Film Festival has a good reputation of being the fans festival. You know, it gets great crowds, people love movies, and so it's always nice to bring a film here. Amazing. I'll always love a tough appreciator. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.